am. I am no doubt, you know, an addict when it comes to my mobile phone. But is this going to be the next generation where you've got this headset or whatever device, which might not look as clunky as this one? And that's all they do. And if they do that over a period of time, will they start to lose um, connection with the consciousness? Is your consciousness going to be hijacked by this mass dopamine hit and, you know, toying with our neurotransmitters in this world? It, doesn't that worry you? Whilst I know this is your gig, um, doesn't that worry you as a human being for a moment? Absolutely. It is, it is a major concern. The one thing I would say to that, though, is <clears throat> I don't blame the technology itself for, for that. But I blame if that were to happen in a significant way that damaged humanity, I would consider that a human failing. Because we are aware of this. We certainly need to talk about it more. and We need to talk more about the, the disadvantages, current and potential of this technology and every other one. But the result of talking about it needs to be some sort of action. So yeah. some sort of um, ability to recognize and safeguard against that happening. And there's nothing, there's absolutely nothing wrong with a little bit of escapism. But the key point there is it's got to be a little bit, right? Everything in mm -hmm. moderation. You know, we all enjoy going to the cinema and being completely immersed in a, in a different world temporarily, you know, yeah. for two hours at a time. But uh, of course, it wouldn't be very healthy if we spent eight hours a day in the cinema. And I think the same concept applies for technologies like virtual reality, where they can be incredibly powerful tools for escapism. But we have to recognize that escape, escapism for a large amount of time is not a healthy thing. And right. therefore, we need to put controls in place. How those controls are enforced, whether they're left to parents or government regulated is another concept. But we definitely need to be thinking about those sorts of safeguards. Absolutely. Absolutely.